What is going on YouTube, man? And we are back with another banger video and I have a surprise for you guys, all right? I got a little bit of a, just a little, little surprise, you know what I'm saying? But in today's video, I am going to be explaining why I sold the Hellcat, man. And y'all might be happy for me. Y'all might be a little bit sad for me. I'm still sad, I know that. So I'm gonna get straight to it, man. Um, one reason I sold the Hellcat was because I just, I'm not a Mopar guy no more. I think it was time to switch, man. You know what I'm saying? We, we did the Mopar thing, the Rowdy and all that good stuff. I think we needed a little bit more muscle on the channel, y'all. I think we needed to bring a little bit more aggression to the channel. So we went and got something new and I'm going to be showing y'all that here in a second. But another reason was because I got an offer that I could not turn down, y'all. If y'all heard this offer, well, I'm going to tell y'all the offer. They offered me 100 k for the Hellcat, man. They offered me 100 k So I hope y'all are ready to see it because this build, look at this, this little cool dog. That's such a cute dog. <laughs> That's such a cute dog. My bad, y'all. But um, no problem, man. That's a beautiful dog. <laughs> like I said, y'all, um, we need a little bit more muscle to the channel. So I hope y'all are ready to see the newest project to the channel. With that being said, let's bring in the new project. Let's get it. Here it is, y'all. I know y'all like, I thought you said you weren't going Mopar. I thought you said we were switching from Mopar. No, we are Mopar only. This is a Mopar channel, so you're gonna see nothing but Mopar, y'all. If y'all believe that, come on now. I've always wanted a truck, so this build, I'm excited to see how it goes. What y'all think I'm gonna do to it? Should I wrap it like I wrapped the Hellcat? Should I leave it white like this? I kind of like the white, but I think that matte black will look tough on here, so. I think that matte black is tall. Look how tall this thing is. It's dang near taller than me, man. It's dang near taller than me. Let y'all see the inside real quick. Come check the inside out. Come check the inside. Out. We got the full leather with the eight-inch screen. So. Y'all like it? Let me know. Well, let me know what y'all think about it, man. Let me know what y'all think about it. Get the front profile. That front profile. <laughs> that chrome, man. We are getting rid of this chrome. We are. I don't know what I'm, color I'm gonna change it yet. I'm thinking of changing the chrome white because it's just chrome is out of date man chrome is old school and all that good stuff so we are going to delete the chrome probably do these black right here there needs there needs to be some black on the side of the truck because it's white and then these are black already so it would just go perfect if we did that but i like it y'all i hope y'all like it too but nothing will replace the hell Cat, man, the Hellcat. I don't even want to keep talking about it because I'm gonna end up crying right now because I miss my Hellcat so much, man. I miss my Hellcat, man. My favorite part has to be about the truck is this granite top right here, man. That made me feel like I'm in a Rolls Royce, you know what I'm saying? I'm rolling around in the Maybach, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Y'all see who's at the Mecham auction? This was here in Tulsa. This was a really good show, y'all. I think it was like last week. And if y'all never heard of this, they go around to like different cities and they do auctions and all that good stuff. Something like that you see on TV, 45, 50, 50, 50, 50, something like that, you know what I'm saying? But <laughs> this is a really good, uh, this is a really good show. I'm gonna hang these up in my garage. I forgot to tell y'all this, it has underglow and the wheel lights already. So I don't gotta put underglow and all that good stuff on it. 
And I'm gonna show y'all what it looks like at night. But like I said, let's walk around one more time and get that full wrap around. Yes, sir. Oh yeah, I forgot to point this out too, y'all. You see we got the Conquer All merch on, man. This isn't gonna be in the giveaway. It's gonna be a different shirt than this. But you know, we got the Conquer All merch. I'm working on uh, building a website so you can just go online and order the t-shirts. I'll let you guys know when that is up. But for now, hit me up in the DM if you want a Conquer All shirt. But I got one more surprise for y'all, man. And a lot of people believe this but if you believe this, you can't fall for this again because we're not gonna ever get rid of it, all right, y'all? But like I said, I got one more surprise and we about to bring that surprise in, let's go. Y'all don't be mad at me, man. Y'all don't be mad at me, all right? It, you, you got it, Mick. It, it kept you on your toes right there, all right? So. There it is. There she goes. <laughs> Got it. <laughs> there she goes. Yeah, buddy. April Fools, you know that April Fools, but we had to get y'all one last time, man. This is the new project coming to the channel. We did not get rid of the Hellcat. I can't get rid of this car, y'all. This is this is my baby right here. I just had to give y'all a little bit of, you know what I'm saying, stomach rumbling and all that good stuff, man. But I put too much money in this car to get rid of it. And I made that same mistake last time when I did that to the scat, the car that's in my intro. I wasted so much money and ended up selling that car. But I ended up getting a Hellcat. But I don't see myself spending all the money that I am and then getting rid of something that is my baby you know what i mean I, I i love this car man i absolutely love this car but we did get the truck this is the truck on the channel y'all these are both y'all gonna be seeing some truck content now and some hellcat content i don't know what i'm gonna do with the truck yet we might go mudding or something go crazy in in the back of the boonies or whatever it is y'all but they look good together don't they they look good together they look real good together. That's why I was kind of saying, should I make them matching and do the matte black on the truck too? Or should I just leave it white? Because that white is clean. And if y'all see, the rims on the truck are white too. So it matches it really well. But I appreciate you guys rocking with me, man. We are now to 1K subs. So we gonna keep climbing and climbing all the way till we get to the top no cap. And I'm gonna catch y'all on my next YouTube video, man. We out. Cash out.